Hi guys and welcome to my channel. Um, today I thought I would do a video on some tips that I have to making your cosplay a little bit better, a lot better, I don't know. It's just some tips that you can do because um, I've been trained in sewing and I've been sewing for years so these are tips that I find make your cosplay look a lot better and yeah I'm going to show you guys today. I'm going to be using a cosplay that I'm working on at the moment to show these tips so it's a Barbie Swan Lake. I will insert a photo here if you don't know what that is um, and yeah let's get started and I will show you how to make your cosplay 10 times better. Let's go! Mounting your fabric. I like to do this for almost all my bodices that I make. Mounting is when you sew two fabrics together. Your outer fabric can be thin or weak and may need an extra support. So adding a stronger fabric can give it that support and it will make it sit a lot nicer. Fitting. If you ever make a cosplay, you'll find that most of the time it doesn't fit your body perfectly. So get a safety pin and pin in the areas where there is a lot of excess fabric. For me, this is mainly around the bust area. Pinning it shows you how much to take in to get the perfect fit. Oh, and make sure not to pin yourself. Ironing can make the world a difference to how good your costume looks. Press your seams on the front and back will help it to sit flat and look amazing. Also to get rid of all those unwanted wrinkles. Ironing makes it look so professional, so never forget to iron. And make sure to get the right temperature, you do not want to put a burn hole in it. Finishing the inside of your cosplay may seem like a waste of time, but it's not. Not only does it finish the seams and make it look great, it also helps the costume to last longer. It stops the fabric from fraying, which could destroy the costume over time, especially if you plan to wash it. You can bind, pink or overlock, there are heaps of ways to finish seams. It brings quality to your cosplay. Inserting boning. For me, this is a must for fitted bodices. Even if it's cheap plastic boning, it all helps. At the start of the making this bodice, you could see the fabric at the side of my waist was gathering. By putting boning in, it helped to hold the fabric against my body, giving me a smooth line. Detailing. This can be anything like cut up bits of fabric, beading, painting, embroidery, and so much more. This gives your cosplay something special. It is time consuming, but it makes your cosplay look unique and intense, which people love to see. So that is it. I hope you guys enjoyed it. I hope it helped you in some way. Even if it's just one of the tips, I hope that helped. Um, if you have any questions, let me know in the comments below. I'd love to hear what you have to say. If you have any more tips to add, I'm sure I'd love to hear that too because I'm always looking for tips and tricks to make things look better. And yeah, don't forget to subscribe. I put videos on every week now. Hopefully I continue with that. Goodbye!